back at it again with another holiday treat for you. And so if you've been watching my channel for any length of time, you know that I seldom bake on here. Like, I don't know what it is about me and baking. Like, we just don't get along. I don't know if it's because it's too, too much science, basically. But I braved the baking world again for y'all, and I'm coming to you with a recipe that I think was worth it. It is vegan chocolate peppermint cupcakes. Y'all even made homemade icing. And so they're real cute, they're real fun. They real happy. I took them to work to share with my coworkers and they also enjoyed them, but I wanna know what you think. So you already know, message me in the comment section below and let me know what's up after you watch the video. And you already know, before you go, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll see y'all next time. First thing you're gonna do is take one cup of your unsweetened plant-based milk and add it to a bowl. Then you'll go in with some apple cider vinegar and then you're gonna gently stir that together and set it aside for it to curdle. On to our dry ingredients. In a large bowl, I'm mixing my two cups of flour with the rest of my dry ingredients. So I've got a little bit of some granulated sugar going in here. And then I've got some cacao powder. You can use regular Hershey's cocoa powder if you'd like, but this is what I like. And now I'm gonna go in with a little bit of some baking powder, baking soda, and salt. And now I am just gonna make sure that all my dry ingredients are nice and mixed together before moving to the liquids. All right, so now I'm going in with my vegetable oil. And now I'm going in with applesauce. So if you don't want a super sweet cupcake, then you can use unsweetened, but I had mocks, so I made it work. Going in with some vanilla, followed by a little bit of peppermint extract, and then mixing that all together. So right now it's starting to look like brownie batter, so we're gonna go ahead and add in our milk mixture with the apple cider vinegar, give that a stir, and then we're gonna go in with the hand mixer. Now I know, like, why would we add a whole cup of coffee to this? It's gonna make the batter really, really runny, but that is okay. Go ahead and put it in your cupcake liners, and then you're gonna put this in the oven at 350 degrees. So you're gonna take your room temperature vegan butter and give it a really good mix till it's nice and fluffy, and then add in the powdered sugar little by little, maybe mix it together so you don't make a mess like I did. And then we're gonna go in with a little bit of almond milk, so just a splash, and then go ahead and mix that together. And then because these are peppermint cupcakes, we're going back in with some vanilla, a little bit of peppermint extract, and then you know what to do, mix it together. Now I don't have a piping bag, but I do have sandwich bags, and as you can see, Icing is pretty thick, so you want to make sure that you move it all towards the end of the sandwich bag, cut the tip off, and then begin icing your cupcakes. Now, as you do more cupcakes, it will get better, but here's the final look. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. Mm -hmm. 